Hey, why didn't you answer my other six calls? I thought you were dead. Yeah, sorry, I was at the doctor's getting a weird mole checked out. What's up? Oh my good lord, you might as well be. Might as well be what? Dead! No, Mom, the doctor said it was benign, okay? He had to take a biopsy just in a case. A biopsy? Yeah, it's just standard procedure. Is it malignant? Stop Googling stuff. I'm not. Uh-huh. Look, I'm fine. I always knew this would happen to me. What? Mom! You no, know you're too young! Oh my... It's nothing! What's your favorite nostalgic emotional song? What's my favorite... Tears in Heaven by Eric Clapton. Why? Okay, yeah, that's a good choice. For what? Your funeral. I know it's morbid, but we have to plan for the inevitable. I'm not dying! Okay! Okay. Jeez. I know orchids are your favorite, but carnations are much more affordable. I'm hanging up now. I'll call around. No, this is great. I think this will make a great vacation house. Yeah. Oh my... What is that? Hmm? Oh. That's just a Canadian. It's 20 degrees below freezing. That can't be a person. Yeah, you'll see a lot of them this time of year, but they're very friendly. If you got a 2-4 and hot poutine, they'll come right up to your door. You could feed them. Really? Yeah, no, yeah, for sure. You want me to call her over? Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, no, yeah, for sure. Sorry, eh? Oh, here she comes. Beautiful, eh? Yeah, no, yeah, for sure. Okay. Oh, look who came crawling back to Facebook. I just need some photos I posted like 10 years ago. Yeah, that's what they all say. And then you accidentally end up searching up your high school crush's profile and see that her husband's out of the picture when she's got a new rack and that's all you could think about. What? Type in your email. Okay. And your password. Okay, uh... That's not your password. Damn it. Nope. Try again. <sighs> Not even close. Uh, you got one more try. Or else. Or else what? I don't know. I guess we'll wait and see. Okay. Nope. Damn it. Alright, you got two options. Listen to me, okay? One. You can send the verification code to the email that you're trying to log into now and change your password. And two, you can f*** off and die. Okay, we'll send the verification code. Okay, I got it. What do you want a f***ing gold stop? Paste it and put in the new password. Okay. Again? <sighs> you always have to type it twice. Can't use the same password as you did before. Uh, no, I didn't! You know, if you are who you say you are, you can do this, all right? You can tell me how many mother bicycles are in that mother grid. How many but What? Uh, three? Wrong. Oh, come on! You have a robot. Okay, twist this one. Mm-hmm. Okay. The other way. Okay. Ease up a bit. Okay. You just want to nudge it. Oh, do you want me to do this or not? Yeah, you're doing great. You're doing great. I won't say anything. Okay, go ahead. Okay. No, I'm done. Oh, honey, I hear you and your feelings are valid. I want to understand why you're feeling this way. Why don't we go get an ice cream and we could talk about it. If you don't stop crying in two seconds, you're going to be standing up on the car ride home if you catch my drift. That's what I thought. Mom, can you buy this for me? Oh, well, right now we can't get that, but maybe we can wait for your birthday or for Christmas. How does that sound? Mom, can you buy this for me? No. Your dinner, sweetie. Um, I actually don't eat gluten anymore, Mom. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Um, but now that I know, I will go do some research and see what other options we have, okay? Here's your dinner. Um, I actually don't eat gluten anymore, Mom. The f did you just say? No, you can't go to your friends because you didn't finish your homework. Well, I'm going to call social services. Okay, let's take a breath. You sound like you're feeling stressed out. Why don't you go get your homework, come here, and I can help you as much as I can. And then maybe when you finish it, you can go to your friend's house. No, you can't go to your friend's because you didn't finish your homework. Well, I'm going to call social services. Oh, okay. Okay. What, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just calling him for you. What? Is that all right? No. I, there you go. It's ringing. No. I, I take it. Okay, fine. I'll do my homework. That's what I thought. Riley. What's this about? I need you to help me fold this lawn. What did you say? I said, what were you on about? Why do you sound like that? 
What's wrong with what I sound like, eh? You come in here and disrespect my family, my blood, my heritage. Heritage, your entire family is from Boston, Massachusetts. You're lying. Why would I lie about that? You have the audacity to lie about Santa Claus being real. Who's to say you didn't lie about me not being adopted from across the pond? You think I would have picked you? I think this conversation is over. What has gotten into you? Riley, the next episode of Peaky Blinders is coming on. Let's go. Oh, figures. It's you. What did I do? You have Riley watching R-rated TV shows? It's educational. How is it educational? Talk me way out of folding the laundry now, didn't I? Yeah, so next time you think about what you say to the picky f***ing blinders. No. Too much? Too much. Um, Dad, Alyssa and I are gonna go to the mall. Oh, okay. Well, when are you gonna be back? Uh, I don't know. Okay, well, we need to know. Well, do you guys just want to come with us? Listen, I don't want to hear any back talk yet. What? Do you want to come with us to the mall? Tom, what's happening? I think they want to spend time with us. In public? It sounds like it. I mean, you hear about this kind of thing happening to other parents, but you never think it's gonna happen to you? Yeah, okay, I feel like we gotta play it really cool. Yes, yeah, so we don't seem too eager and scare them off. Like, yeah, whatever, if you want us to. Yes, oh, yes, that's good. Like, we did have plans, but I guess. Oh, that's good, I believed you. Very cool. As a cucumber. Are you guys coming or not? Oh, uh, I guess. There is nothing in the world I want more! Okay, we can take my car. Okay, great. Oh, nice. As cool as a cucumber. Okay, go play, kids. Yeah, go on. Movie. Sounds good. All right. So, how are they doing? Oh, they're great. Buddy just got off his first school suspension and is doing some volunteer work. Involuntarily, but... Oh. And Tex... Well, he's alive. So... Yeah, I know what you mean. Um, can we get some juice, please? Oh, sorry, we don't have juice. Oh, well, they will not touch water even if they were dying in a desert. Oh, you know what? You guys go play. I'll get you something. Riley refused to drink water, too, until I got these air up bottles. <laughs> you just fill it up with regular water, put the lid on like so, and then you put on a flavor pod, and then you lift it up to activate it so when they sip it, the smell of the flavor pod is what it tastes like. Oh, that's like when I bake cookies and I don't want to be bad and eat them, so I just sniff them a lot, but then I just wake up at 2 a.m. and eat them all anyway. Yeah, kind of, but no. Anyway, try it. All right. Phew, that's good. Well, I'll be. That's a miracle. If I'm not ending up in prison one day would be the miracle. What was that? Nothing. <laughs> oh, oh, I got it in. Nice shot. Yeah, good shot, babe. You get another one now. Oh, cool. Oh. Oh, don't worry, babe. You can try it again. Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> no, she can't. Dude, chill. That dude chilled me. That was a scratch. What, we're just giving out pretty pity girl passes? Bro, this is her first time. She's never played before. Give her a break. Oh, and I've never skydived out of a plane before, but you think if I forgot my parachute on the first try, I could just slap down an Uno reverse card on my sh**? No! There's no rewind button on the game of life, man. Only play. And maybe pause or fast forward if you're under the influence of certain substances. This isn't skydiving, bro. This is pool. She can go again without any deadly consequences happening. You sure about that? Yeah! Oh, no. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You know what? Let's just start Derek Jeter throwing rules out the window, right? Let's just start robbing banks, you know? Lighting cars on fire. Sleep with each other's moms. Or whatever. Do you sleep with my mom? You know what, man? Just give her another turn. I think it's fine. So good. Oh, thank you. You too. What's up, What's up, buddy? Ooh. Oh, <laughs> bring it in. Bring it in. <laughs> oh, you smell nice. Yeah, new cologne. You like that? Yeah, I like that. Oh. You been working out? Yeah, check this out. Look at that. Oh, shit. I gotta start calling you Humpty Dumpty, may I? Now get in there. Oh, yeah. As hard as a rock, right? We need to talk, Chris. Well, now's not a great time. Well, it's never a good time, is it? Uh, what's that supposed to mean? You've abandoned us. Your family. Abandoned? I just made a video about you less than two weeks ago. First it's two weeks, then it's a month. Then you never see us again. 
no, you're not. You're like family, okay? But I'm a creator. I need to evolve, okay? I have other channels, okay? I'm writing a movie. I'm making a movie. Is it about me? No. Then I don't care. Oh. Myself and company just want you to promise you're going to continue to have us in your content. Or else. Okay, is that a threat? I'll leave it up for your interpretation. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, what is this? This is not okay. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Okay? Oh, yeah, Mom, it's just a little cut. It's fine. Oh, my. You need stitches. Stitches? What's going on? What? No, no, it's fine. It's small. It's fine. Oh, it's all my fault. I should have splurged. You got the Costco knives. These Walmart ones are slippery. I oh, got. Where's the first aid kit? Dad, we don't need a first aid kit. Then your great aunt Linda cut her finger just like that, and then it got affected, and she died. Who? Exactly. Oh, my God. You guys, it's... Is that an ambulance? What Thank is... you. In here, fellas. Oh, thank God. Seriously? What happened? I cut through my finger! Alright, well walk it off. Uh, walk it off? What is going on in here? The queen of drama. Uh-huh. Oh, can you still move it? No! Are you really trying? Yeah, I'm trying! Rub some dirt in it, you'll be alright. Okay. Hi. Hi. Did you RSVP to the party tonight? What? Oh. How was I supposed to know she wasn't invited to the party? Like, I made the guest list, but still. What party? Mom's half birthday party, of course. No one informed me of this information. Well, maybe if you weren't so busy looking at your phone, you would have gotten invited. Maybe if your plastic surgeon did a better job on your face, I wouldn't have to look at my phone so much. Not you trying to gaslight me. Not you pretending to know what gaslighting means. Yeah, I do. It means you're being a bitch. No, it's not. And you'd know that if you spent less time looking up the grams of sugar in a celery stick and spent more time reading a book. I don't need to sit here and take this. Come to the party or don't. No one cares. You can bet your plastic ass that I'm coming. She's just a light gasser, manipulative human being. And I was planning on having zebras and ostriches come to my mom's half birthday party, but I wasn't planning on having a sneak come. Riley, we got- What the hell is this? I am currently concocting a Wixers in the toilet. Why? No, thank you for asking. I have currently developed a keen interest in alchemy and the mystical sciences. Oh. Yeah. And I'm using the toilet as a vessel for my concoction, so at the ease of one flush, I can send them out into the universe. Oh, uh-huh. And what will that do? If my calculations are correct, and I believe they are, it will make all the bad people in the world dissipate into sparkly dust. Oh, uh, is that why you added my brand new highlighter into the mix? Ma, uh, how perceptive you are. Yes, that is correct. Got it. Yeah, yeah. And after this, I was thinking of doing my own interpretation of the Sistine Chapel featuring the cast of the Paw Patrol and permanent marker on this wall. Uh, counter-proposal. You draw it on paper, and then we put it on the wall. <sighs> You're really pigeonholing my creativity, but I, I can do that. That's great. Would you like to do the honors? Sure, why not? We did a good thing. That highlighter was $50. It didn't look good on you anyway. Done dinner! Okay. Oh, you didn't finish your water! It's gross. What do you mean it's gross? It's water! It tastes like nothing! Exactly! What's the point? To live! Me? Okay, well lucky for you I got you an air up water bottle and all you have to do is get a scented flavor pod, put it on like so, and then pull it up to activate it and then when you sip it, it'll taste like the flavor pod. No day! Oh, is that peach? Uh-huh, and I have a bunch of different flavors too, so you... Did you like it? Yeah. Great. More water. Uh, more water. In my air up bottle. More water in your air up bottle. No. No, you know what? One battle at a time. Babe, you ready to go? Yeah, I'm ready to go. You were in that?
What's a new cardigan I got? Do you not like it? No, no, no. You look beautiful. Let's go. Okay. Okay, baby, ready to go? Yeah, ready to go. You sure about that? Yeah. Huh. Well, I just got this new cardigan. What, you don't like it? You're beautiful, but it's giving, I don't want to miss the 4 p.m. senior supper special because bingo's at five. Okay. Is it time to switch to transitional lenses now, too? It's big talk coming from a guy in socks and sandals. Hey, these are Birkenstocks, okay? You look like Adam Sandler. And you look like you grew up watching cartoons that wouldn't see the light of day today, so. I love you, let's go. I love you too. Oh, you forgot something. What, what'd I forget? Your walker? Oh, honey, I like the new hair. It's very funky, very fresh. Thanks. Yeah, very dope. Don't say that. Okay. Knock, knock, kiddo. Mom told me you got a new hairdo, and wow, that's different. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you doing okay mentally? Yes. Well, then I think it's great. Oh, your hair is so cool. What are you gonna do, copy it? No. Oh, okay, thanks. Wow! Excuse me, I didn't mean to interrupt your mission, Agent Romanov, but you're looking fine as chilled wine in the summer time. <laughs> thank you. No, thank you. Hair's cool. Wait, really? Do you mean that? Yeah. Thank you! Okay, I have not been sure because everybody's just been giving me mixed signals, and this- and now I know. Now I know. Thank you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Your outfit looks dumb, though. Okay. Okay, and welcome back to Anger Management Group Therapy. Today we're going to be talking about methods that we're using to help us calm down. David, how about you go first? Journaling, mostly. Good. Leonard? Uh, Ronan. That's great. Bob? Hmm? Oh, yeah, uh, meditation and incest lately. Sorry? Incest. It's been really calming me down. I highly recommend it. Dude, what the f***? Remember quiet voices. Sorry. Dude, what the f***? With who? I live with my brother, so usually him. Okay. You're gay? David, volume. It's not gay, David. Humans have been doing this for thousands of years. Okay, we're here. Let's bring it to here. Is he okay with that? I mean, he complains about the smell sometimes, but he knows I'm going through something, so... That's insane, man. Oh, what? You can write down all your feelings in a Hello Kitty diary, but I can't light up some lemongrass incest once in a while? Oh, you're talking about incense. Pretty sure that's illegal, last time I checked. Okay. Why are you chicken? Your hair looks really good. What? Oh, oh God, no, no, no. I have, I have not washed my hair in, in several days. There's so much dry shampoo and hairspray in there that if you flicked on a lighter within five feet of me, I would spontaneously combust. C c come to think of it, I haven't showered in, in several days. I probably smell disgusting right now. I, I shouldn't be in public right now, to be honest. Uh, I, I, I'm I genuinely sorry I have plagued you with my feral existence. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I think you smell fine. Listen, if you're looking to do charity work, go down to your local food bank and shove soup in Oliver Twist's mouth, not compliments into mine, okay? That was too much. Too much. Yeah. Whoa, you gotta read this. Okay, uh... You done? Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> A man is dead, Chris. Yo. I didn't read it. Just gotta move that. Oh, there we go. That's a good fire. Great fire. Solid fire, yeah. Oh, it's my favorite smell. Shoo, best smell. I think I could survive in the woods for like a really long time. You made this fire with an Us Weekly magazine gasoline and a Hooters TV lighter. No, you could not, Steve. I could too. Oh, really? Shh. How long do you guys think I could hold my hand in that fire? No, Todd, don't. Ten seconds. Rick, are you f dumb? Ten seconds? Ah! Five seconds. Todd, why? <clears throat> you owe me five bucks. Five bucks? I didn't agree to sh You guys think Morgan Freeman could actually be God? Every day. Probably. Okay, I got my headphones, my stun gun, my bear mace. Does this work on people too? Probably. And do I need this? Little overkill. Never mind. Okay. All right, run time. I got my headphones in, music on. See you tonight. Okay, it's gonna be sunset soon, so this has got to be a short run. Oh, I gotta take one headphone out too to hear any potential approaching threats. Sick, it's gonna be dark soon. Nobody's gonna be out here. I'm gonna go for a scump on this run. Hell yeah, let's turn this music up. Yes, I know. Is that truck slowing down? Why is it slowing down? Oh my god, I'm gonna be on Dateline shit. Is that truck slowing down? Weird. Oh, they probably need my directions. Hey, man. Oh god, another runner's approaching. I gotta not breathe so loud. 
Hold it in. Hey. Oh, yeah. Fuck out, a man is approaching. Okay, what was that self-defense class I took three years ago? Oh, look, a woman runner. Okay, I gotta seem not creepy, not intimidating. Here we go. Okay, not creepy. Hey. Oh, God, that was so creepy. Oh, God, that was so creepy. I'm going on star power mode. Good morning, beautiful. Oh, good morning. Mind if I grab a sip of your coffee before I head out? Oh, yeah, sure. Thank you, baby. Okay, kiss. Bye. Bye. And hey, I love you. I love you, too. I love you more. Back up! Oh my god, I almost dropped my coffee! <laughs> Ow, but you didn't. Uh, bring it in, bring it in. Oh, I need a sip of that. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna head out. What'd you drop on the floor there? What? I don't know. <clears throat> I'm out of here, short stack. Love you. Love you too. So what did you want to tell me? So keep this to yourself, but I think I might be moving to a different city. What? Why? There's just more opportunity and it's only an hour away, but this is super early stages. I don't even know yet. So just, just please keep it to yourself. Oh, well, okay. Okay. It, where are you going? I'll be right back. Okay. You're moving? What? Okay, hold You're on. You're abandoning your family? Dad. I'm I just kidding. Grandma? No, I'm not moving. Why should I turn on the TV? I this thing on? Hello, everybody. Thank you for coming. Um, my daughter is, is moving. She's breaking apart this... Sorry. Thank you. She's breaking apart this family. She's outside the house? I'm just going to leave it open to questions. Anybody? Yes? Oh, my God. I, just, I don't think I can be without him. I don't think I'm strong enough. You're right. I am a strong, independent woman, and I don't need anybody to tell me that. <sighs> Thank you. Oh, right.